What to do if he cheats on you? Is he cheating? No. He is a cheater. He will cheat again. Today's question came from Tara. Tara says, I think my partner is cheating on me. I've noticed that he receives many messages late at night and he always hides his phone. If my suspicions are true and he has someone else, then what should I do next? I don't want to leave him, but how can I be with the person who betrayed me? Thank you, Tara, for sharing your story. First of all, I would like to ask all the viewers to write a few words in the comments or at least drop an emoji to support Tara in this difficult situation. And let's talk about what to do if you think that your partner is not faithful. The first step is Find out the truth. Just tell me the truth. I'm not the police. Tell me the truth. There may be a few reasons why a man hides his phone besides cheating. For example, some men like to watch porn, but they're not sure how you would react, so they hide their phones. Another reason might be that maybe he has a female colleague who is going through some tough times and it happens that she shared some of her emotions with your husband or your boyfriend during lunch and now she's reaching for additional support. You might say that mm -mm, this is a red flag of potential future betrayal. That seems like a red flag to me. And yes, it might or might not become romantic. But if he is not cheating on you right now, then there is still something that you can do about his new friend. He honestly might think that he is helping this poor lady. He is in a hero mode, which is one of the common reasons why men might cheat. And I talk about it in the second part of this cheating video series called Top Common Reasons Why Men Cheat. Watch it after this one. So, if you suspect your partner is cheating on you, the first step is to find out the truth. At this stage, you still have a chance to connect with your partner and talk about your relationship. You can tell him about the emotional distance that you feel with him. Maybe you can plan a romantic getaway or just go on a date to bring some novelty and spark some passion in your relationship. If you have suspicious feelings but don't address them, it will only increase the physical and emotional distance with your partner. Soon you will get even more suspicious and will keep torturing yourself and doubting your partner. Please do not avoid difficult topics. Tom, I think we should talk. We have some things we should talk about. Take this as an opportunity to learn more about your partner and yourself. This conversation can really help you to grow as a couple. He might not admit the truth, but you will actually know it by his reaction. If he rejects your accusation, you can ask him to show his phone. Can I see your phone? Sure. Yes, it's his phone and his privacy, but you're not invading it without his permission. You're asking him to show it to you. Yeah, he said it's everything's fine, nothing to be worried about, but I have to see it to believe it. If you want me to create a video about how to talk to your partner, how to say it, what to say, let me know in the comments. By the way, if you are in a difficult situation and need my professional advice, just type your question in the comments. This is a great opportunity to receive my professional guidance free of cost. So if you think that he cheats on you, the first step is to find out the truth. By the end of your conversation, you will know the truth one way or another. There are only three types of reactions that you may expect. A. He admits that he is not faithful to you. B. He will blame you for accusing him and distance himself even more. And C. He will be more attentive to you, more loving and more caring about your needs and will be willing to work on your relationship.
If after the conversation your suspicions disappear, then go and watch my video about 7 biggest mistakes in relationship to avoid. This video will help you to rebuild trust and emotional connection with your partner. And if you find out that he is cheating on you, then go to the step 2. But before that, if you're new to my channel, my name is Elena Semenek. I'm a psychologist. This is my YouTube channel, Psychology of Happiness. Welcome! Every week I release a new video about self-esteem, relationships, anxieties, limiting beliefs and all other essential topics that will guide you to manifest all your dreams and have a fulfilling life. Start watching my videos one by one. I have 500 plus of them on my channel and I guarantee that sooner than you expect, you will become a happier, healthier and more successful person. Subscribe to my channel and click the bell to turn on the notifications so you won't miss my next important video. Ok, let's continue talking about what to do if he cheats on you. Ok, so uh, let's continue. If you find out that he is cheating on you, then the second step is to leave. You need to leave to give yourself time and space to calm down and process your feelings. You need to take care of yourself first. Go to your friend's house, to your family house or just rent a cheap hotel for a day or two. If you live together, your place have lots of memories and these memories will only add to emotional pain. Also, by leaving, you are showing your partner that you are serious and not willing to stand his betrayal. You need the space and time to go through your feelings. You will have a roller coaster of different feelings – anger, sadness, disbelief. You may blame yourself for not seeing the red flags. You might think that he cheated on you because you were too busy or because you neglected him or because you did not have enough sex with him. What did I do wrong? I mean, is it, is it my... Is it my fault? To get a better understanding of your partner's behavior, watch the second part of this video – Top Common Reasons Why Men Cheat. The link is in the description. You need at least 48 hours to process your emotions. Why wait? Why not break up now? It is always good to have a good friend, a family member or even better, a therapist on your side. Maybe it will just like clear your mind out. During this time, stop any type of communication with your partner. Do not answer his calls. Do not reply to his texts or emails. He might come up with some excuses and even tell you that this was a mistake and he wants to be with you. Please do not involve yourself with him. Just distance yourself from your partner for at least 48 hours. When you are ready, you will have to make a decision if you want to stay with this person or if you want to leave. Clear your mind and focus on what you want. Based on your decision, you will follow with the third step of this video. But before that, if you like my approach and if you find my video helpful, then I will be happy to be your therapist. Don't you want to be happy? Happy? Is it even possible? Sure. I offer private online sessions and I am the founder of the Happiness Club, where members have immediate access to my unlimited healing database of breathing exercises, journaling techniques, art therapy and much more. In my Happiness Club, you can also enroll into three healing courses. 1. Healing your inner child, 2. Overcoming emotional eating and 3. Program yourself for success. Visit elenasemenek.com slash happiness. Ok, the third step if you think that he cheats on you is take actions. And what is the verdict? So what are you going to do with all that now? If you decide that you don't want to be with your partner, then create a plan for how you can pick up your things, figure out what to do with the apartment if you rented it together and cancel any future plans, vacations and holidays that you booked together. Wait, 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 wait. What if I want to stay? Oh, please give me a second chance. 
if you decide that you want to give him another chance, then first make sure that he is on the same page, that he still wants to be together and is willing to work on your relationship. Talk to your partner about the possibility of doing couple therapy. There are a lot of aspects that you need to heal. Betrayal reveals a lot of issues in a relationship and you will need to address them one by one. Well, there is one more thing we could try. What is it? And the next step, if you think he cheats on you, is to watch two other videos. One, top common reasons why men cheat. I talk about four reasons there. And number two, wife versus mistress, consequences of dating a married man. If you enjoyed this video, give me a like and share it on your social media. Start watching my videos one by one. I have 500 plus of them on my channel. And I guarantee that sooner than you expect, you will become a happier, healthier and more successful person. If you are new to my channel, then grab my free gift of five free self-development webinars, five guided meditations and five healing exercises. Visit elenasimonek.com slash free or click the link in the video description. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you soon in my next important video. Bye.